Hello everyone. So Infosys Pragati Part 2 Future Cohort 7 course list has been released. The most awaiting part like for which almost all girls were waiting for the course list. So it has been finally released. So here is the mail which I got from the Infosys. So here is the mail which I got. So in this video I will be talking uh, how to do these courses and all. And who should do this and who should not do. And what is the last date for completing the courses and certifications? So you can see the mail. Any two courses and one certification at Infosys Springboard by November 9. So by November 9, 2025, you need to complete two courses. Means from this list, course recommendation list. So here are 10 course recommendation. Out of this 10, you need to do two. And from certification recommendation, there are total of four, right? Out of that four, you need to complete one certification. Means one, one certification you need to do. Okay. So you will be selected only if you complete two courses and one certification from the required content. So once you get selected, they will update you about the next steps, schedules and everything they will send to your mail. So please keep checking your mails. And I will also be posting the latest updates about Infosys Pragati. So do subscribe to my channel. And don't forget to click the bell icon. So for every 15 days, they will be checking your progress. They will be tracking your progress. And learners who are not consistent or do not meet the module requirements may be removed from the cohort after a fair discussion. So if you are new here, don't forget to hit the subscribe button because I post the videos related to tech updates, career updates, job updates, internship updates, free courses and placement preparation guide everything so please check out my videos and do subscribe to my channel and you can also follow my social media handles like linkedin instagram so i will show you how to complete the courses so first one let me show basics of business communication you can just click on that so if you click on basics of business communication then you will be redirected to the login page so here is the page you can just click on login if you are a new user, you can register or if you are an existing user, then you can give your email and password and login. Otherwise, you can give your phone number and password. You can log in or you can just log in with Google or you can give your phone number and OTP. Okay. So, after logging in, you will find this basics of business communication in order to start the course. You can click on start button and here you can see the contents to be completed you need to complete all these contents if it is a video you need to watch if it is a material you need to read and then write the final assessment this is the interface of the assessment of this course in this the camera access won't be taken so you can write it easily and you need to uh, for writing exam you need to click on start okay so after completing the course you can view your certificate here or if you want to post it Post in LinkedIn, you can download here. You will be getting the certificate within 48 hours to 72 hours of your course completion. So, in the similar way, you can go with another course also. So, the next one is certification. You can choose any one of these from the certification. So, I am clicking on Python. So, here is the course. In order to take the test here, you need to complete all these. You need to complete this, then only the start button will be enabled here. So you can take the test. And during the test, the camera will be on, and you need to get at least 65% in it. So otherwise, you will not be qualified for this. And again, you can take the test after 14 days. If you fail once, you can take the test after 14 days. So I will show you how to do this. Click on this. In the similar way how you did for courses, you can go through, start, here you will find the videos and when you click here, you can find all the contents. After completing all the contents, you will need to write this assessment. In this way, you can complete first pre-content of Python. In similar way, in the similar way, you can go for other pre-contents also. For every course, you will get the certificates which you can post in your LinkedIn. Complete the two courses and one certification, then only you will be eligible for the next modules and make sure you are completing all the courses and certification 
and keep checking your mails for further updates so this is a golden opportunity for every girl so make use of it and by just being consistent you can visit the infosys company to share this with your friends too so you together can complete these courses and you can together go to the infosys campus so if you have any doubts regarding this video or any other video from my channel you can so you can just drop them in the comment section i'll surely reply to them so the benefits of the cohorts i have already mentioned in my previous video so if you want to know them you can check my previous videos i'll post them in the description so if you like the video please like share with your friends and don't forget to subscribe to my channel that's all for today's video see you next video till then keep learning bye bye